Hey guys, it's Benny from WeAreWordNerds.com. I'm back. It's Friday, and this, yep, Friday reads. Okay, you guys, so comment down below. Let me know what you're going to be reading this weekend because I have, like, brain fry right now. Like, I when I sit down and try to think of something to read, like there are so many books that I have on my shelves right now that I haven't read. It's almost overwhelming and I can't make up my mind what I want to read. So maybe if you tell me what you're reading and you can be like, no, oh, it's amazing. And I'll be like, yeah, it's on my bookshelf. I should totally read it. So that's what I'm wanting. I'm really just posting this video because I want you to tell me what you're reading this weekend. As for me, I'm going to try to read Dead Village by Holly Capella. I had put out on Twitter a couple of weeks ago that I wanted some horror books to feature on the website because we lately it seems like we've been getting a lot of kid lit and not necessarily anything that I can sit down and read that's going to take more than, you know, 20 minutes. So I put a call out on Twitter. I would love some horror, and so some horror started coming in. This is Dead Village by Holly Capella. The main reason I'm picking it is because it is short, and I think that is part of what I need right now. I need something short. This book is 196 pages long. So this is something, if I'm into it, I'm going to be able to knock it out in an afternoon, right? I hope. So let me read to you a little bit of what's on the back. It says, After strange happenings isolate a small resort town from the rest of the world, nearly 100 residents seek refuge at the closed hotel. Only eight survive the night, and that's just the beginning. So that's like the big tagline that's on the back. I think it sounds really interesting. I love the cover work. Um, I'm not really put off that it's an indie book. I really don't care. It's something short and something scary to kind of... You know, because it's October, it's Halloween month, and I don't know. So this is what I'm going to try to read this weekend. Comment down below and let me know what you're reading this weekend. Help me get out of my reading slump. It's all up to you, you guys. So anyway, so that's it for me. If you watch until the end, as always, thanks for watching, guys. See ya.